can't connect to Wi-Fi on laptop. How to fix. Many people have been confronted with this problem, where you're doing everything to connect to the internet with your laptop through the provided Wi-Fi and nothing is working. The reasons for the lack of connection could be as simple as turning on the router unit to ensuring that your modem is well plugged in. At other times, just restarting your laptop will reboot the network drivers and you should flawlessly connect to Wi-Fi as before. Here's a list of things you should check to solve the problem. Check your Wi-Fi network first for issues. As stated previously, the problem could be something as simple as plugging in your router to a power source to switching it on. At times, it's that your laptop is trying to automatically log in to another Wi-Fi network. For this, you'll need to set it to forget the other network and automatically connect to yours. You should also ensure that your laptop is as close to the router as possible. This is to eliminate any incidences of interference. Sometimes the problem could be that specific website servers are down. You can try out logging into multiple websites to rule out this problem. You should also try restarting your router by first removing cables from the router and modem. Wait for 30 seconds and then plug the modem back on. Wait for a minute before you plug in your router. Rebooting your router can fix any existing software problems that are preventing you from getting a solid connection. Device problems. Once you have checked your Wi-Fi network for issues and the problem still persists, then it's time to move to your device. The problem could be with your laptop, especially if other people are getting a solid connection and are not experiencing any issues with the Wi-Fi. The first thing you should do to fix the issue with your laptop is simply restart it. If this does not work, you may want to check your network adapter. For Windows laptops, go to the Network Connections panel and ensure that the panel labeled Wireless Connection is enabled. If you have a Mac computer, then identify the Wi-Fi Airport card that is normally found on the top right corner of the screen. Click on the option Turn Wi-Fi On. If you can't find it, then go to the System Preferences on the Apple menu and choose the network icon. Then click the Turn On Wi-Fi from there. While rare, at times the problem could be that your network adapter drivers are out of date. Going to the Device Manager and updating your software should solve the problem. Renew your IP address. At other times, the problem could be with your conflicts in your IP address. The solution is to renew your laptop IP address. To do this, go to the Run Command box on the Windows Start menu and type in ipconfig forward slash release on the open field. Wait for the command to be executed. After this, type ipconfig forward slash new and press enter. This should successfully connect your laptop to Wi-Fi. If the above methods fail, then the problem could be that a third-party antivirus software is trying to block the Wi-Fi on your laptop. Turn off this software until your laptop connects. You should also run a malware test for viruses. At times, a computer virus may block your laptop from receiving a solid signal. If you have an old laptop, then the problem could be your network adapters stopped working due to computer overheating. All these steps are attempts to troubleshoot the problem. There are times that after trying all of these, your laptop still does not connect, and at this point, you need to take it in for repairs so as to rule out hardware problems. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know which video you would like to see next from us.